Well, here comes the corrupted superhero. You know, I often wonder, does Nikki even want to try to find the right path? Eh, probably not. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making our way to the ring from Glasgow, Scotland. Almost a superhero, Nikki A. Inspirational or delusional? I say inspirational, motivational, impactful. How can you not be a fan of Nikki A.S.H.? Easy. She's delusional. Such a Debbie Downer. What does almost a superhero mean? It means you don't need superpowers to be a superhero. You can be a superhero by just doing the right thing, by just trying your best, Michael. So if you left the commentary desk, would that make you a superhero, Saxon? Because that's the right thing. That's a bad example, Corey. And representing the Outsiders from Miami, Florida, Victoria Hall. No matter how high the deck is stacked, this one competitor will never give up. Well, as long as never giving up is the only strategy they bring with them into the ring, the odds are they will always be stacked against them. A determined look on her face. She knows how to prove herself in the women's division. Hard not to be excited when this superstar is in the ring. A competitor who has no limits. She wouldn't know her limits if they were right in front of her, Michael. Some might think she's reckless at times, but it's impossible to get her to change her ways now. And I wouldn't expect her to fight any different in this matchup either. And then you've got Nikki A.S.H., WWE's resident superhero adjacent superstar. Yeah, and don't let the costume fool you. Nikki's about as tough as they come. Wrecking the shoulder. She's looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. Now look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. She got launched. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Boom! to go from commentators to participants in this one, fellas. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. The referee counted, urging them to get in the ring. Manages to beat the count and get back in the ring. With no time to spare, really. Not the position you want to be in right now. Snake up! She covers for the pin! Kick it out before the count. Wow, I thought for sure that was it. Ooh, what a nasty kick. Just disrespectful. Not exactly the upper hand Nikki hoped to get. Oh, forget about pandering to the WWE Universe. That should keep her head in the game. Springboard Bulldog. Off the ropes. Leg drop. Into the cover. Oh. She pops the shoulder up in one. Amazing effort by her. Nikki stopping when she should be going. Not exactly faster than a speeding bullet here. 
Ooh. Ripping and tearing at the face. As these two face off, I have to say, if I'm the one facing off against Nikki A.S.H., I would do everything in my power to slow her down. Good point, Corey. We all know Nikki loves to get her momentum going, loves to come at her opponents from all angles. My goodness, is this even legal? I don't think so. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Momentum is really on Nikki's side. Nikki is absolutely unloading here. Ow! Foot, meet, back. The fatigue is setting in for her. Ooh! Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Nikki now with her opponent and delivers a Samoan driver. Patented offense right there from Nikki A.S.H. Oh, kick right to the spine. She scurries out of there. She heads out of the ring, but she needs to pay attention to the ref's count. She throws her back in. Whoa. Nikki heads up. This is going to be good. You can tell she wants to put an end to this. Nobody home for that one. In full control of their opponent with more in mind. This is punch. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Here it comes, Byron. Oh. Look at the height. It is the outsider's edge. Nikki's in serious danger. Wow, just barely making it out. Are we sure that wasn't three? Uh, just about as close as you can get. There's got to be some sense of desperation right now. She's used her best weapon, but the match still continues. Very effective. This one is headed outside, guys. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh, not a powerbomb onto the apron. She's showing signs of slowing now. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Oh, come on. Why would you stoop that low? And Nikki only finds herself on the defensive. And Nikki A.S.H. desperately attempting to gain back some sort of momentum, but that is not written in the stars right now. Toss back into the ring. Nikki striking a superhero pup. Cutting her off there. Smart strategy. This match is coming down to the last second. Someone's got to get back to the ring now. Off the ropes. Got to find a way to get out of this. Uh-oh. No! Oh, yeah. She's saying, let's go. Bring it. She sent back in under the ropes. Places her right in the corner. And it's a long way down from there. This has got to be the beginning of the end. From the middle rope. Oh, no. Fall away slam. Nikki's really out of it. She might be done soon. Impressive ring IQ on display there. Boom, nice. You can see Nikki's eyes tracking her nemesis now. Oh, this could be something. Neckbreaker. Will Nikki seal the deal? Makes a cover. Almost had her, but she gets the shoulder up. She was barely able to get that shoulder up. I cannot believe she had the wherewithal. You got to give a lot of credit here. Withstanding what has taken out many other competitors. Stop after stop after stop. Absolutely brutal. Ruthless. Shoulder tackle. This match may be nearing its limit. She is barely standing at this point. Off the ropes. Leg drop. 
And Nikki's maintaining the advantage now. Yeah, Nikki is executing her game plan. We're seeing an unbelievable performance in front of us. And how these can... Oh, look at this. Is it enough, guys? Is Shot it enough after... to get back in this match? Wow. So far, so good. Oh, quite an effective counter. Yeah, her instincts are taking over. Put into the corner now. She's up on that top turnbuckle. She won't be for... Fellas, I think this one is about to end. I agree with you, Corey. A massive... Shoulders down. Could she finally put this away? And she wins. That is a huge victory. That had to be one of the matches of the year. Let's take another look at some of the action. Here is your winner, Victoria Hall. That win took everything they had, and then some. No one was willing to give even a single inch of ground in this battle. At times, it seemed like these competitors were totally deadlocked, but here you see the one who prevailed. Here we go. She is ready. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, representing the Misfits from Louisville, Kentucky, Carrie Taylor. The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match is going to be good. She has been counting the weeks, the days, the minutes until this match, and she is now ready to compete. And from Los Angeles, California, Rose. Just look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger? Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? Such a talented competitor. I think we're about to see one of her best matches yet. And here's a woman on a mission. She has the singular goal of being the most dominant superstar in the women's division. And she has no issue getting in your face about it either. She doesn't care who she has to run over. There is no second place for her in any competition. And she has to face a woman who has been at the top of her game. It's going to be hard for anyone to take on a superstar with the kind of trajectory she's been on lately. A thunderous powerbomb. into a monkey flip. Face bust, will it be? No, she kicks out. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Drop kick right on point. And momentum is fading away from her. She has to rely on her instincts to turn things around. Oh, oh, oh. Got their opponent set up. Oh, drop kick to the back. Looking bad for her here. 
Dutching out of trouble. Oh, man, what a hit. Really just laying it in. Oh, what a close line. Feeling the WWE Universe on another level. This is her fuel. She's pushed into the corner. <laughs> what a forearm. She scores big with the counter. Going up high with the punch. Sends her to the outside. The wheels are turning. Suicide dives. Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke and it pays off. Ah, oh, right to the back. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. Whip back into the ring. With the reversal. Oh, what a close lock. Momentum's all with her now. She's fighting hard and reaping the rewards. Scratching and clawing, this could be it. Stopping the ref's count at two. She just won't stay down. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Whitney Lariat. And set right into the corner. Uh, setting him up in position here. On the second row. Tornado Boom. DDT. Viking DDT. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Oh, that hurt to the spine. Picking the spot. Momentum's breaking away from her. Yeah, but now we'll see if she can hold up against this burst. They've got their opponent all the way up and rib breaker. Taking a moment to let her know who the real superstar is here. And now she delivers her back into the ring. Uh-oh. Thunderous powerbomb. Oh, man. And she's using this moment to summon all of her strength. Split legged leg drop. There's two. Still in it. What a gutsy performance. You can sense what her intentions are here. She's going to try it again. She just created a prime opportunity. And that'll about do it, folks. These ladies put on quite a show. Here's another gander. Here is your winner. So perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamrolling. Ah, the dirtiest of dogs. The show off. And one of the toughest veterans on the entire WWE roster. 
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Dirty Dogs from Hollywood, Florida, weighing in at 218 pounds, Dog Ziggler! You know, Dolph Ziggler has twice been the sole survivor at Survivor Series. Well, sometimes you forget just how much Dolph Ziggler has really accomplished in WWE. But this is a superstar who has stood the test of time. Uh, he's truly a top dog, no doubt about that. Look at the size of this man. Seven foot three inches tall, 400 pounds. The true colossus of WWE. And his opponent from Lagos, Nigeria, weighing in at 400 pounds, the Nigerian giant, Omos! The size of Omos must be seen to be believed. Looms over the entire ring, and the locker room for that matter. Omos is just as powerful as he is towering. Right about that one, Saxton. Omos truly is one guy you don't, under any circumstance, ever want to mess with. Gentlemen, just take a look at the size of this behemoth. It is a scary, frightening sight looking up at a man the size of Omas. Tom Ziggler seen as a veteran at this stage in his career. Still feels like his match is always going to steal the show. Dolph's always had that confidence, but what I like the most is how Dolph doesn't care anymore if you believe him or not. He goes out there for himself to shut the naysayers up. Well, Ziggler yet again has another opportunity to silence doubters and steal the show. And standing across the ring from him is the human Redwood Omos. Just a towering, terrifying marvel of a human being. All the raw power and athleticism you can imagine. Omos has all the potential in the world to become a major superstar. He sat under the learning tree of top talents and is now ready to stand out on his own. Thrown back in under the ropes. What the leg? Look at this. He just tossed the leg. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Ah, oh, foot just stomping down. Ziggler may be in trouble here. What a barrage of stops. Oh, sharp knee. Ziggler looking evasive. Check your face after that one. Ziggler telling the crowd what he already knows. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Placed into the corner. Ooh. They have them in the corner. Ooh, slash. Corey, for as good as Dolph Ziggler is, he does have a tendency to come up short. Do you have any insight into how he can avoid that happening again? You should definitely put aside any doubters that sound like you, Cole. But in this case, I'm thinking Ziggler... He's going for the pin. This could be it. He's able to beat a two count. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match? Bullseye! Oh, headlock takeover. They don't call Ziggler the show off for no reason. Oh, this is just disrespectful. Oh, look at it grind the features off their face to cross the top rope. Oh, 
Omos looking to end this. Choke slam for the pin and the win. Yes. Got it. No, just a two. What do you have to do to put this guy away? Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Down to opponent and a double axe handle smash. This match is brutality starting to show on him. Yeah, as Omos clearly just wants to continue to impose his will with that. Axe handle finds its target. Able to give him the slip. Ooh. Ooh. Ow. Loving blow to the chest. And he tosses him back in now. Omos has set his target. Up high, Omos with a ring-shaking spine buster. Dumps in La La Land. And that's all she wrote. Let's look back on the action from the last match. Here is your winner, the Nigerian Giant, Omas! And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. Make way for the It Couple. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Maurice. From Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz. These two are such a wonderful couple because they have so much in common. Title reigns, reality television success, being beautiful. Here's another thing they have in common, Corey. They won't shut up about it all. Why would you shut up about that? These two even tag together at WrestleMania. It's Ugh. truly a beautiful love story. I wish you'd shut up about it. We are graced by the presence of two all-time great competitors. They inspire each other to be better. I'm inspired because they are their best when they are at each other's side. It also makes the cheating a little easier. Byron, stop grabbing my leg. Oh, sorry. And his opponent, from the bottomless pits, weighing in at 260 pounds, the Boogeyman! Oh, the Boogeyman might make the opposition eat some worms tonight. Or eat them himself. Well, either way, it's a bad night to be a worm. You never know what the Boogeyman is going to do when the bell rings. I don't think even the Boogeyman even knows what he's going to do. This guy gives me the heebie-jeebies. Do they sell worms at those health food stores you go to? Absolutely not. The Miz out here, set to compete in this matchup. Guys, do you think we're going to get a focused Miz tonight? Absolutely. He's got the shoulders down. 
Not quite there yet. Not even a two count for him. Oh, there's a headbutt. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, the world's strongest flat. Big forearm. What a shot. Ah, oh, look at this. Just cranking it out. Cranking the head. You can see the dismay on the face of the Miz. Yeah, the boogeyman really remaining the aggressor here. Oh, what a close lock. Sit crashing to the floor. The Miz hot dogging right now. That's nothing new. Bad predicament right here. Powerbomb! He's taking some good hits. The mind games of the Boogeyman coming into play here. Yes, he didn't come here to watch him boast and taunt. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. Close line! What impact! And now the pace of this match being set up by the Boogeyman. You gotta wonder, what does this do to Miz's confidence? Miz is such a dangerous competitor. Even with all the skills in the world, we all know he's not above taking shortcuts. You can't fault the Miz for being smart and bending the rules to his advantage, Cole. And if you want to beat him, you can't be afraid to bend those rules either. You really have to try and beat Miz at his own game. Hits him with the counter. Now Miz looking for some momentum. Also a good chance for Miz to gain his wits about it. With the counter. Oh, no, 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 no. A big splash. Getting him into the corner. What a shot. Torturous focus on the leg. Punishing the leg. Ooh, tough hit to the legs. Just attacking the legs. Had Miz's playbook scouted. Working the Miz. Grabbed up and driven down. Boogie Bob! Did Boogeyman clinch this? Two count. He did it! He did it! We got our money's worth with that one. Take a look. Here is your winner. The Boogeyman! He definitely got the job done tonight. We really saw what these competitors were made of here tonight. Yeah, especially the winner. He's every match with the same cold confidence. Nothing shakes him from his dark purpose of eliminating any and all opposition. Yeah, it's a grim determination that drives Priest in the ring. And if I'm being completely honest, it's kind of chilling how nothing seems to break his focus. Yeah, I have to agree with you. Priest's unflinching nature is a little disturbing. And he'll be facing off against the uh, visionary Seth Rollins. Oh, put some passion behind it, Saxton. He is the visionary. He is the revolutionary Seth freaking Rollins. All's fair in love and war, gentlemen. I saw nothing but effective offense. Oh, man. Producing a trampling. And he's able to counter. Ah, oh, jumping knee strike. Lights out. 
Oh, no. Oh, I stop right to the gut. Oh, my goodness. There's the jumping oh. knee right to the face. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. Uses the edge of the knee. Taking this to the floor. Control. Caught with the boot. Damien veering his attention away from the match. Not the best idea. Oh, man. Kick to the face. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. He's testing fate here in danger of a count out. Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Ooh. And this is just a vulgar display of ruthlessness. My God, enough! He's got him down, is this it? He gets the shoulder up at two. He got close there, it could be do or die time. Setting up neck breaker position. Oh, forearm to the back. I hate to say it, but you have to think Rollins' worst enemy in this match might ultimately be himself. I absolutely agree. Rollins goes in expecting victory, and when it doesn't come easily, he tends to get sloppy. My advice to him, don't get caught in your own head. Visionary put every ounce of passion into that move. And Seth Rollins picks up the win. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. Here is your winner, Seth Freakin' Rollins! What a big win for Seth Rollins. A very impressive victory for Seth Rollins. The King Slayer.